Gala Games has conducted a massive, massive token burn, removing nearly 21 billion Gala tokens from circulation. I'm going to blow your mind when we talk about how much this is worth and what this means for the future of Gala. Of course, they recently just got through their V2. Make sure you are um, getting your tokens. We're going to go over and highlight uh, how you can make sure you do that uh, as well in this video and uh, make sure you're getting your V2 airdrop to you. And uh, it's pretty easy, actually, especially if you're using a thing like MetaMask. We'll dive into that a little bit here uh, a little bit later on in this video. But we have to talk about these burns right now because part of the reason why Gala made the shift to V2 was the ability to make these burns possible, right? Uh, having more control over their ecosystem. So this is the tweet that I wanted to highlight here. Let me take you inside uh, this right here. So check it out. Go Gala Games has conducted a massive token burn, removing nearly 21 billion Gala tokens from circulation worth over $600 million. This initiative aims to build trust among token holders by reducing the risk of a significant token dump. We highlighted this yesterday. Basically, uh, Gala Games burning over 600 million worth of their Gala tokens. Gala Games announced this week it is removed or burned almost 21 billion. Again, $637 million worth at the time of the burns uh, from its own reserves. This is the key here. They're burning it from its own reserves in an effort to reduce that risk, right? The tokens we hold, we have received an ecosystem rewards. Over the last several years, the Gala Games team wrote in a blog post, while they have always been tokens we were used uh, using to fund the growth and curation of the ecosystem, we know that many people see them as a fundamental risk to the overall tokenomics of the projects. Uh, project. So in short, Gala Games believes that a massive token burn will help reduce concern among holders who may worry that the company could sell off massive amounts of its own token, a move which would lead to a decline in price. Now, we all know that that would be kind of crazy to do because the blockchain doesn't lie. You can see these transactions happening. People would freak out. People can put faces to the names and, and, and they would be pissed off. I don't think Gala would ever do that. But there are some people out there who look at this and say, wow, this solidifies Gala for me, right? Because this was the big you know, thing that I was concerned about. And now it's not an issue. So Gala detailed its approach to burned in the post, noting that it had already planned to burn 2 million Gala as part of their 2023 vision paper uh, for the year, which we've highlighted earlier this year. Another 3.96 billion tokens were then burned, which Gala Games said was equivalent to the total revenue in Gala we have ever received. The additional and largest burn of 15 billion tokens represents Gala's response to community concerns over the noted dump and exit possibility. Gala pointed to on-chain Ethereum network transactions for each part of the overall burn, and wrote in the post that it represents 660 million worth of tokens. According to CoinGecko, the tokens were collectively worth approximately 637 million. We're just saying it. We're just saying over 600 million. That's a lot, right? So again, uh, very interesting stuff here. And uh, here's P2E, uh, play to earn news covering it. And uh, of course, Gala Games, huge in that sector. Uh, now, over on Twitter, Jason Brink, aka the Bitbender, says you may need to go add your token to your specific wallet solution to get it to your display. Just Google, how do I add a token to Bloop MetaMask? And it will pop up when it asks you for a contract paste in that right there. I went ahead and just pasted this in where I'm holding my gala over on MetaMask. You know how it works. Uh, they airdrop them right to you. They were right there and uh, no issues whatsoever. And uh, whatsoever. So I think a lot of people are getting it done and uh, there's how to if you guys need answers. Uh, go over and check out Jason. He's got a ton of content on his Twitter all about the move to V2 uh, recently that has taken place. So let me know how you guys uh, are feeling now about Gala. Does this change anything for you, this massive token burn? Uh, for me, I guess it just solidifies my stance on Gala games and where I think the future of GameFi and the future of this ecosystem could be heading I think it has massive, massive potential. The fact that Eric Schiermeyer and their team now are going mobile, in addition, they already have uh, you know, upwards to around 15 PC games. I think when it comes to GameFi, Gala could be setting the pace for every other company out there for years and years to come. 
So it's not one game. It's an ecosystem. It's an entire ecosystem and packages of games that I think are going to set this entire sector apart, and Gala will be a big reason for it. I think there's going to be billions and billions of dollars coming into gaming, crypto, uh, in this next cycle, maybe even trillions eventually, and Gala's got a great upper hand and a great head start in what they've already built and what their plans are now for the future. That's what I stay, uh, that, that's where I'm standing right now on Gala. Let me know what you guys think down below. If you like this video, let me know by subscribing to the channel, hitting the like button, sharing it out with a friend, and we'll see you in the next video. Take care.